Okay, pilots, we found the Nautilus Tep. She is hiding in a stellar gas cloud within the Phi Iridani system. Given the presence of both the Thathugwa and the Tolsha in system, this setup indicates something much more widespread and dangerous than even the Nautilus Tep by herself. These ships had to come from somewhere, and GTVI is still puzzled as to their source. The only current speculation that we have is that the Nautilus Tep was part of a larger fleet that has been lying dormant in subspace for thousands of years. Dr. Hadamard's speculation that the Narlathep was indeed the Lucifer that destroyed the civilization of the ancients seems both the most plausible and the most troubling. The Narlathep herself was residing dormant in subspace until a few weeks ago, when she emerged through a rift created by the explosion of the MT Mudinari AWACS. While it was not clear at the time who was controlling the ships in that subspace battle, subsequent evidence has revealed that Morgan Technologies is behind much of the recent criminal activities in these systems. However, the Narlathep's presence seems to be just the beginning of something darker. 37 years ago, the Lucifer appeared in Ross 128 with no apparent source or reason. The Sheevan simply came, and even until today, no one truly knows where they came from. Our recent experience has shed light on that war so many years ago, and yet it does not bode well. We barely escaped with our lives from the last Sheevan invasion, and if the Narlathep is not alone, the danger is greater than we first imagined. We need information, and we need it now. We have pinpointed the location of the Narlathep, but we do not know her present activities. Before we launch any kind of strike, we are going to need some accurate information on her location and her status. We are fortunate to have a handful of Mara-class fighters in our possession that have been converted so that Terran pilots can fly them. I hope you've been brushing up on your Shivan etiquette, pilot. You're going behind the lines. At 17.15 hours, we pinpointed the source of Sheevan transmissions in the Phi Iridani system. The Narlathep is located in the small stellar cloud that until now has been masking all of our scans of the system. Our recent engagements with the Fathugwa and the Tolsha helped us to localize the Narlathep's haven. At present, the GTD Valhalla is on standby and will be waiting with a small strike force of GTVA ships that will be ready to deploy in three hours. The information that you provide will be used to launch the strike against the Super Destroyer. Your task is simple. In captured Mara fighters, get close enough to the Narlathep and scan her navigation, communications, sensors, weapons, and fighter base subsystems. Your fighters will appear to be Sheevan, right down to your EM signatures, provided that you do not get too close to patrolling Sheevans. The interference created by the stellar gas cloud should provide you with enough cover. However, steer clear of other Sheevan fighter patrols in the area. If they get too close, you will be readily identified. Given the Tolsha's escape when the Thasugwa was destroyed, we expect this Lilith-class cruiser to be in the area. If it is present, scan the cruiser and any other capital ships you find. Do not engage any ships or it will ruin the element of surprise. Keep a low profile, Alpha. Remember to keep at least 500 meters between yourself and the fighter patrols.